when we look at that 400,000 plus truck fleet that Penske has, that is by far the biggest emissions factor for us as a company, is the tailpipe emissions. Fossil fuel powered vehicles make up about 28% of greenhouse gas emissions. So starting with converting transportation to zero emission vehicles is a great place to start. And Penske is at the forefront of these changes. Penske has really elevated our zero emissions vehicle program for the last 30 years to help address the customer's needs as well as address ongoing legislation that is pushing for the adoption of the vehicles. Penske has a unique challenge with medium and heavy duty trucks in our fleet and the goal of reducing greenhouse gas emissions. Fleet operators have a completely different set of expectations and challenges compared to a regular EV application you might have at your home. They need to deal with regulatory compliance, regulations, as well as the local utilities. When you install charging infrastructure, the infrastructure alone is not enough. You need a software solution that removes the guesswork and tells the fleet operator how much to charge, when to charge, where to charge, based on various external factors. When we think about how Penske is set up, it's what we call a fleet of fleets. So we have over 400,000 vehicles that we manage or help manage for our customers, and they all have their own needs and wants and aspirations. Working through the gritty motion EV charging system with Hitachi has been a very close collaboration to get us to the finish line. Hitachi first came to us with a solution for EV charging that was unlike what we had presently used. We really felt like that partnership would help us lead to something that could be improved and really put out in the market, being the first one in North America. Penske approached us and wanted to know if we could provide anything in the charging area. And sure enough, Hitachi Energy was also coming up with the, the charging infrastructure solutions. So it was kind of first for both the parties. For Penske, Stockton facility, one megawatt depot charging solution was the first of a kind. And for Hitachi, it was the first solution in Northern America for the charging infrastructure. How it differs from a typical EV charger is we're doing bulk power conversion. We're converting from AC to DC at one time. We have 10 charging pedestals that can charge trucks at 100 kilowatts each, or we can configure it such that we can have five trucks charging at 200 kilowatts each. It can accommodate all of Penske's vehicles all the way from class two panel vans to the class eight vehicle or a tractor trailer you might see on the highway. The power conversion together with a bank of DC to DC charging modules all in one compact box enables us to reduce the footprint up to 60% and cabling up to 40%. Achieving something like Gritty Motion and deploying it here in Stockton and looking to deploy it at additional locations in the near future is something that we can both be proud of and it creates this collaborative leadership. But this is just the tip of the iceberg. As we move forward, more and more trucks are going to become electric. We have to move towards a sustainable society. We have to go green. And this is just a revolution that has started. And we are all proud that we are part of this revolution. We know that we can't do electrification on our own. Hitachi can't do it on their own. We need the trucks and the charging facilities and everything to work together. So it really does take a village. And by us collaborating, we can be leaders in this area across the transportation sector.